welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV Blind. Going with the level 25 archery quest here. Seems like a reasonable plan. Always good to get these done here. What are we up to? We got all sorts of rewards, they're all great. Since we are skipping quite a bit forwards here, we're like level 15 ish on the main scenario quest. Other quests we are even further behind. So a level 25 quest is gonna give us some pretty great stuff. Which makes a lot of sense. Guildmaster Hussein wants you to attend to your fellow archers. And we also get a new weapon here, which is also a win. It's a longbow. Hmm. That's alright. Damage, auto attack speed, delay. <laughs> More regular stance too. That's alright. Ah, uh, Arctic. I've hoped you would come. You may be able to help. I'm concerned about Le and Silver. They show signs of losing perspective. And, well, mayhap is best you see it for yourself. Can I help but feel that both would benefit from your counsel? Consider this a personal request, Arctic. We have gone from the newbie here to now helping. Hey, how's it going? Hmm? <laughs> oh, gods. Did the saint send you to pester me by any chance? This is hardly her concern, and it most definitely not you it's most definitely not yours. If you must know, I've decided to leave the guild. I mean to track down Pawa Majak and finish what we started. The gods, quiver, and wood whalers seem content to ignore our warnings, but I will not let her escape again. I already made that mistake once. It cost me my place in the gods' quiver. I, the foolish young sentry of whom I once spoke, he was me. <sighs> we had her, Arctic. There was no escape. But then she began to wail about a wounded comrade, one who would surely die without her help. She looked me straight in the eye and begged. And I blinked, failed to see through the most elementary ruse. I failed Gudania and the gods' quiver. And while that can never be forgiven, mayhap I can reclaim a measure of honor by stopping her. But a wanderer like you would not understand what it means to betray your people. Worry not, I do not intend to leave just yet. I'll continue to gather information till I'm certain of Hunchak's whereabouts. Make no mistake though, it's only a matter of time. Now run along, will you? Oh, and if you're so concerned about your fellow guildmates, you should attend to that moping Koti. The sight of her shuffling around while staring at her feet is bad for morale. Not that it matters to me. Uh huh. <laughs> Eh. Oh, it's you. Tell me, Arctic. Do you ever think about home? Do you ever wish you could go back? My was just another poor village in the Twelves Wood. The fields are more stone than soil, and merchants hardly ever bothered to visit. We didn't have a lot, but we didn't need it. And then the calamity came. I remember running and screams. It was so loud, Arctic. So unbearably loud. And then, I was here, in a strange city, surrounded by more people than I had ever seen. I didn't know any of them. I knew how to hunt. I was always good at hunting, Arctic. And the guild gave me a place to get better. At least I thought I had gotten better. She, oh, Majak, she was so much more. I've been thinking, Arctic, that maybe this is a sign. Maybe Silver is right, and this guild, the city, is no place for an outsider like me. So I've decided to leave. I'm glad to have known you, Arctic. Even if it was only for a short while. Forgive me if this is too selfish of a quest. But before I go, I'd like to meet with you one last time. Alone in the South Shard. South Shroud. These Gridanians would not understand. My goodness. Meet Land Island in the South Shroud. We can do that. They did not take our failure to capture very well, did they? <laughs> Let's go to South Shroud. Central and North Shroud. We go Central Shroud. Yeah. That's not quite what we need. We can go to the Central Shroud. Access to the South Shrouds over here. Let's jump over to Bent Branch Meadows. That's be the fastest way. 
Or, we go to the South Shrine. We have not attuned here. Or here. I guess we're going to be getting closer to Quarry Mill. Yeah. I guess the best we can do is Vent Branch and run from there. Probably be worth it to get more teleport locations here. The question does then become, which three locations do we want to save? We have the three cheaper teleports, and then also the return. So we got a few things we can work with. I don't think we can manage that from... away from it. Do we have a chocobo keep down that way? Chocobo Porter. Gridania. Quit. Looks like no. <laughs> Looks like also no. Stuff shine. Do we have chocobo keep here? Maybe they can't go between zones. Some of brothers. I thought we would have that. There's a dungeon right there. Alright. I guess we are running south. Go for a sprint. <laughs> it works. At least a little bit faster here. I can work with that. Lower level areas. Increases movement speed by some amount. Looks like all the increase we can get here. We're good there. Got a left nuts around here. We are doing absolutely fine on this currently. the south shroud. Right across this line. <laughs> and we run. We just run over towards where they're going to be. More quests here. Let's see if we have the chocobo key here. Probably would have. We didn't spend a huge amount of time in this area. Triple keep. Triple porter, higher triple porter. <laughs> I'll need a higher triple porter this time. Should see our birds will allow travel locations you're familiar with. Chocobo Stop offers different routes, where you may only select routes leading to destinations where you previously traveled. Do not visit any of the locations accessible from this one. It is unavailable. Okay. So it doesn't seem very connected, then. It's unfortunate. Well, that this way. Well, also... I mean, I guess we could probably... What we're looking for in the hunting quest here. I suppose they have their names. Upper Lanaska. East Shroud. And the Bramble Panch. I guess some of these are Lanaska. Valian, South Shrine. They're, they're all over the place. We'll find them if we see them. Not too worried about it. So we're going down here through the roots. This way. Silent armor. With some antelope stags. Okay. Hey there. No, don't hurt him. 
And there I was... Oh, hold on, one sec. Oh my goodness. And there I was, thinking you might, mightn't accept my kind invitation. I don't recall inviting him, though. Tis rude to presume. Presume, Sonny. And I do so hate rudeness. Wait, it's not his fault. It's mine. I invited him. He's a member of the Archer's Guild, like me, and he's not Gridanian. Ah, I do begin to recall his face. I knows how to hold a bow, that one. Well, he ain't the typical recruit. I reckon I might be willing to make an exception. Oh my goodness, what are we getting ourselves into this time? <laughs> no, no, it's not like that. I just, I want to say goodbye. I think ever since I met Paula, I've been at a loss. But I realize now that my place isn't at the guild with the Gridanians. They'll never accept me. This is where I belong, with my people, carrying on our traditions, our archery, not Gridania's. It's all I have left, Arctic. So I'm going with Paula. Maybe you don't understand now, but just promise me you won't tell Usain or Silver. Are you kidding? <laughs> That's ridiculous. No, 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 no. Arctic. Heh, <laughs> I had a feeling he might be harboring a few niggling objections. Worry not, sister. Shoot the bastard. <laughs> Oh, no. <laughs> no! <laughs> Ain't no love lost tricks ye in the guild, is there? Then what's the problem with Feather and a bloody venturer? No bugger will miss him. I'll miss him, all right. So just, just stop. Dear me, I had such high hopes for you, Miss Alipo. Waste a bloody time. Keep her what's lost her nerve about as much use to me as a glass bow. There's no sport in killing captured prey. Ugh. Better not see neither of you again. Cause if I do, I'll show you what happens to prey that's daft enough to get caught twice. Away, sisters. Away. How do you do it, Arctic? How do you live in this place with these people? And why do you even bother? What have they ever given you besides scorn? Well, what do you see in them, Arctic? Even though you joined the guild after I did, you come so far, so quickly. Maybe you, you've even surpassed me. I have to know how you do it. How you've done it. I have to know what it is that I'm doing wrong. There's only one way I can think of to find out. Meet me at the back. Hey. Right. That was definitely some wild choices on her part. My goodness. Alright, we're here over here, we're gonna try to pop over this way. Probably not going to save it or anything. Oh, here's, here's a guy. From the quest. Red Belly Sharp Eye level 26? That's fine. Let's see if we can get a position where I'm not looking at trees. Easier said than done, of course. Also got venomous bite. That's pretty wild. That's more of a cubist. Larsener. Head to the He's not even. He's not even our target. <laughs> For log 24. Red belly sharp eyes, specifically. Yes. Hmm. It's hidden behind the tent.
items. And those sharp eye guys around here. Oh, 27. That's a bit. Exactly what we get for the chain bonus, but probably something pretty good. Look out, look out, arsenal. We got one more specific guy we're looking for. There he is. We got a friend though. We feel like we can take on two guys at the same time right next to each other. Possibly no. Possibly, worth giving a shot. This friend just doesn't care. Line of sight, also a thing. You just climb up here and I'm gonna raise out on the top of this rack here. <laughs> Definitely a system. <laughs> and that goes. And that is. I'm going 24 complete. Amazing. You didn't town here. Or, if it even really is a town. More of a fort here. Wood whalers. If you chunk them all, keep here. <laughs> Having a good time with the poison for a while. But the auto healing is dealing with it very nicely. There we go. Attuned. I'm going to go back to the back. Left mats. Yeah, right we can definitely afford these teleports. Not a huge deal. Especially with the ones we have favorited to make them cheaper. It's all good. I just need to... There we go. <sighs> Who knows if things would work when you spawn in? <laughs> the timers go down. Nothing else works. <laughs> With the way this is able to always be up, it could almost just be a passive. When would you not want to be moving slightly quicker? It's instant. Just goes off when you gain combat. That's fine. That's fine. More. The Venom. Duel that we're having a duel. <laughs> Shall we begin, Arctic? Or maybe we're just having testing. Commence battle for homecoming. Level sync in effect. If you are above the maximum level allowed, at least sync to styles level 29. Nope, only level 25. The correct level for this. Then defend yourself. Show me what these people are talking about. Yeah. Hopefully not duel to the death. That'd be unnecessary. I said, "Fight me, Why are you holding back? I'm not holding back. Oh, she's got. 
wonder if that started as a regular shiny. It's a hunting falcon. We're gonna falcon fight. It's gonna keep running away from the falcon. My people, for my family, for me. <laughs> They got Falcons though. That's pretty neat. Well, they got attacks. Ah. I see now. My goodness. You okay? <laughs> yeah, she's fine. <laughs> it's so simple. You've opened your eyes, looked beyond your master's faults. You've accepted their teachings and taken them to heart. Even still there, for all his bigotry, which is only to preserve his traditions. I lost sight of everyone else's struggles and became obsessed with my own. I was so afraid to let go of my cherished notion of archery, my family's notion, and learn another way. I didn't want to betray them or dishonor their memory. But I have a family here too, a family that sees the wider world and is willing to show me how blinkered I have become. I try my best. <laughs> As archers, we train our eyes and minds to be unforgiving, to defy any attempt at concealment, and discern the naked truth. It is little wonder, then, that I have neglected to look inside myself until now. Though unquestionably worthwhile, I found the experience rather excruciating. <laughs> Thank you, Artic. I know, I now know that I belong at the guild, together with you and Lusain. And yes, even that bloody Wildwood. God's help me. I think I might actually miss him. Do we have to stop him from leaving too? We're really keeping this whole thing together. <laughs> Run! Turn! <laughs> Alright. wonder if we had chosen differently. She would have actually went with them. Probably not. I don't feel like they would. Don't know how much branching story there is. I think her not wanting them to shoot me would probably have been enough for them to not let her join, anyways. <laughs> Alright, I'm not. I should kill Been a, been a whole thing out here. Gotta run really quickly into the building here. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Welcome home, Arctic. You need not say a word. One look at Leia's eyes was enough. Thank you for returning her to us. When you focus on a single goal and pursue it with passion and fervor, it becomes easy to lose sight of what else lies before us. With your skill and vision, Arctic, you can help your fellow archers to look beyond themselves and remember their comrades. Hope we can count on your support in the future. And press complete. We get the longbow and something here. A lot of these are larger upgrades. I guess this is the most. Strength, dexterity, vitality, hit rate. Direct hit rate, even. I'll take the jacket. Velveteen shirt. And there we go. Next quest here is level 30. The one that got away. That's gonna be him. We are now level 30, though. So. Let's get a shirt here. Looking snazzy. Look at that. Okay. Next thing to do. Let's see if we can't keep working on this. More bits. Venture in need tank. I know if This is just random guild 
tanks get bonus rewards, potentially. Dungeons. Yeah, this one. Here on the half shell. Look at this one previously. Weaken the Guild Turtle, slay fire sprites, use their chorus to light special herb on fire. The smoke puts the creature to sleep if he's close to the flames. That sounds like something. There's probably gonna be a lot of these. Since that's still only level 15. And we were level 25. <laughs> what if we can teleport around? I'm working with these. Kind of want to get back over to what we're doing here. That is only in those elements now. We teleport there for 617. Or, alternatively, we could take the flight path there. Could probably save Zulaminza as a preferred location. If not even just the return. Because we only really need to return here every like five levels currently. It depends on what we're trying to do, I guess. around here too. There's a lot. So we make our way over where we need to go. Airship tickets. There's a, there's a, only 120 instead of like 600 by teleporting. We're not in any rush right now, so I'd say worth it. Standing on the ship. Hopefully the group doesn't pop while you're in a loading screen or something. It can take a little bit. Sounds like it is. Please load. <laughs> it's like 45 seconds on this or something. We still need to do the landing cutscene. <laughs> yes, yes, we're here. <laughs> Casually walking. Great shirt. Come on. <laughs> Ten seconds left. <laughs> Alright. See so we get done with all this. We can end all kinds of stuff. Alright, here we are. There's the herbs. Herb patch. Capture the kill turtle. You know, weaken it too. Stay out of the. Here are the little guys. Are we? We're leveled down too low. We can't use the AOE here. Give him bands. He's still really choking on guys. It's more of an extended battle here. Everybody's getting out of the attack range. Good. Herbs going. Probably we can stay. Quickly. Fire, fire sprite stuff. Fire sprite stuff. Fire sprite stuff. The core of light ash drives me. It's been lit. It's in poison. It's 
slow down. So it comes to slumber. Here we go. Perfect. So a little bit of all kinds of stuff there. Very good. Serving a prayer promise. That is for doing five or something. Amazing. Solid performance. So you know your way around the battlefield. Something that I may work with you again at a later time. Bonus. And additional for no one dying. I think it would probably be a challenge to die in some of these. I'm sure. I'm sure you could try. <laughs> Alright. And now we're here. Another one pop up. Yep. Pulling poison posies. The foresters land traps have reached maturity and begun releasing noisome pollen clusters in their efforts to reproduce. When taken into the lungs, the pollen can cause severe irritation, nausea, in case of extended exposure, even death. These vials seeking must be dealt with, or the entire twelve wood is engulfed in a cloud of despair. Okay. I'm just gonna go for the first time. You should bounce here. Level 20. Gotta defeat a whole bunch of poison guys. And we're outside here. Lift. The drowning wedge. So the average time is 9 minutes here. Probably. Talk. Finish this. Oh, it's a cutscene. Ah! Can we escape these at all? Questionable. So other people talking to him. I, such a task was on the books. Was, mind. I'm afraid that ship has already sailed, friend. Yeah, we are we already dealt with it. Eh. <laughs> ah, might you be the adventurer who accepted the job of investigating Sestasha? Yep, that was me. I got these goggles there. <laughs> hmm. It seems that ship has not only sailed, but now returns to harbor. None the worse for its voyage. A pity. We dug our boots too long on this one. No matter. Then we will turn, and our chance will come. You are right, of course. Well, there shall be no rest till we have attained our goal, lofty though it may be. Now, we can sleep, great leader. <laughs> our aim, lest you wonder is to perform such feats of heroism as will earn us a place in the songs of every alehouse in Eorzea. We need to write a legend which will inspire adventurers as yet unborn to follow our shining example. Do you have such a goal? Can we commence this? We'll see what this does. We didn't finish anything. We'll see how that is. They're doing a job. We're doing a different job. That was a lot quicker than nine minutes. Average wait time. It's a whole thing. Alright. Duty commenced. Who's going with gas? Need your health? Don't do that. Okay. Sense a hostile presence. Over there. Now upon this, we have a chance to strike it down. We're clear of the we have pollen clusters. As long as every blow you land, do not let up. Look at us. Got a lot of guys here. Oh, toxic. Longer now. <laughs> Here we doing a great job. There you go. Plenty of poison there, that's for sure. The mist, it returns. Alright. Operation was a success. Here's your payment for your efforts for a little extra. You can see returning to hit us once again. Bonus, bonus. Lots of XP to be gained here. Level up. 
26. Very good. My goodness. Okay, it looks like we're still at the same section of this. That's fair. For level 26, it doesn't look like we unlocked anything else in particular. Any more of these? Stinging back. Choice band of outlaws, known as the Red Belly Wasps, seem to establish a new hideout near the Thousand Maws of Totorak. Once the leader's attacked, he will summon nearby allies to his aid, including powerful conjurers, skilled in the arts of healing. And these allies, before engaging their leader, will greatly increase your chance of success. Okay. This is level 20. We're not getting more basic training, it looks like. It's fair. We're not going to... I mean, we'll start this again and see what happens. It's the same thing. We can skip through it until we got to the part we were at before. We got a few minutes, in theory. <laughs> we did put on our new bow. We should put on our new bow. Okay. Now we can sleep. <laughs> I'm... Lest you wonder, to perform such feats as heroism, or as a place in song of every alehouse in Eosia. We can derive a legend which will inspire adventures as yet unborn to follow our shining example. Do you have such a goal? Large or small, it matters not. Only have a star to reach for, and you will reach higher. Purpose can sustain you through times of hardship. Keep your eye on the prize, and all obstacles will be overcome in time. We're gonna stop entering this cutscene. <laughs> it's not seeming to work out too well in our favor. <laughs> Alright. So we're going to try to deal with all this. Let's all these guys. Let's play attack something. Get some lookouts on them. Deal with the Chantrix here. They're trying to heal. Oh my goodness. <laughs> the healers are healing each other. the healers first here. <laughs> oh, I saw one strike. Swarm point. We took out the guys in front first. I don't know if we would say we did anything Spectacular here. <laughs> there you go. Average success, payment, bonus, bonus. There you go. Level sinking. Anymore? 
All's well that ends in the well. Hostile sylphs would rather see the trolls would burn make before making peace with the people of Grenania. Have begun using their forbidden magics to charm the forest creatures into doing their bidding. Temporarily enchanted, enhanced by the spells, these turned creatures now possess the ability to enfeeble their victims with terrible poisons and wide-reaching attacks. While by slaying their the renegade sylph leader Braxio of the Well, the creatures' minds be freed. I bet now when we don't click to continue, it's going to actually take the six minutes. It seemed pretty solid in the in some extra XP department. It's just interesting to do all the ones. I don't know if we would really have any interest in redoing anything of these. The first time completion bonus is just so much more. This is also where we're getting all this gill. My goodness. 2,600 bonus. That's a lot. What's the reward for... What's up here? Character... Oh, that's two. Journal. It doesn't look 600. Oh, yeah. Might be plenty more from doing actual dungeon stuff, too. Can I get to there from here? Oh, actually, look at all the quests exist. Level 2, level 3. Be a marauder. Blacksmith. That's good. Yeah, there's there's plenty to be done here. I suppose we could get there via the internet. That's kind of where we want to be once we're done with this. Look at the number of duties here. 10, 10, 15, 15, 20, 20, 25. There's probably going to be another level 25 one after this. And then we'll be caught up, essentially. What if this is a first time on each character kind of thing, too? We get all this bonus XP for all that. Where are all these guys at? Upper Lanasia. East Shroud. Upper Western Hemlian. South Shroud. East Shroud. They're just all over the place, basically. That's alright. North Shroud. Eastern Thanland. Southern Thanland. North Shroud. Central Shroud. This is going to be just, just all over the place, basically. Look at all these rewards. XP. That's pretty good. Then we have all the other classes to do, too. Wild. Like I was saying. <laughs> Once we start trying to not do the cutscene here, it's going to take six minutes. <laughs> Western Anasia is favorite in. I just favorite this one. It's definitely it's definitely faster to just teleport. Once you get to the area, you make it work better. That's gonna be what? Upstairs? Probably. Or downstairs, maybe. Lower decks. Upper decks, middle decks. All the decks. <laughs> there it is. Just look, look at all the questionables. Oh my goodness.
duty commenced. This kid, alright, just invited a party of two units. Toxins overwhelm you. Here's Braxy. He's dying. Fire is a rush to his aid. Some of your allies are after reinforcements. Enemy's B. Just gonna not worry about it. Just Zerg rush down the boss to win the game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Brother of SST. GG indeed. <laughs> Amazing. Who needs to do the mechanics? <laughs> Who needs to do mechanics? You don't need to worry about all the guys coming in because you can just win before they become a problem. It's a more efficient strategy, that's for sure. Find uh Taking sticks and taking its names. A lot of those country of goblins have seized the matron's land, preventing a passage to and from the upper reaches of the Twelve's Wood. Now all those who approach are greeted with a shower of time-activated bombs. Trust them behind makeshift barricades. So the goblins defeat their leader, reclaim the area, so travel to the forest be safe once again. They're definitely interesting. Right. We're gonna set. Let me set this home. Where's your favorite, dude? Favorite this over Aleport, I guess. Because from here, if we favorite this, we can teleport. Even favorite, it's like 300 here. That's very cheap to teleport over there. Or just take the boat, also an option. 196, though. When we teleport back to New Redania, it'd probably be about the same back and forth, one would think. Like 300 to get over here. That's acceptable. I work with that. Let's head back to where we need to do this cutscene once we're done with this. Because, by the looks of things, this should be the last one required. Since there's been two at each of the brackets here. Very good. There would definitely be more, like, loot and such from doing actual dungeons. But for the first time bonuses, these are definitely worth it. Let's see if we can find more dungeons. I've seen a few dungeons on maps and such. From out there. There's a dungeon there. We don't know what they are. Whether or not we need to unlock the dungeons, we just show up. Also possible. What level they all are. Seems like there's quite a few of them. Over here. This is the Southlands stronghold. A bunch of spots. Barbs, seed bang.
It's not specifically a dungeon, though. North Shroud? There's definitely plenty of sections out here we haven't been to, too. 500 to go over there. My goodness. Average wait time, average wait time. What's over here? Why isn't it challenged? Only really scalp deep. Well, 15 somethings here. Not regular quests. The other situations. There's lots. There's lots to do. Definitely no shortage of stuff to do. Get this in. Finish this cutscene. It's all working out. Let's see if we get some main scenario quests to go to a specific location. We can pick up a bunch of other quests in the area, maybe. Kind of just need to focus on this for now. Ultimately, we can do anything. There's just so many things to do. There is definitely something to be said for getting in a different class to do all the lower level quests. Because then that experience would be more interesting than grinding away on the starting levels. Since there'd be nothing else you could really do. <laughs> How good of experience just running dungeons would be. Seems pretty good. Question would be if we have access to all the same things on the other bits here. Possibly not. Obviously, they need to be at least level 15 for it. At least that one. It doesn't give, like, XP rewards or anything, because you actually get all that. We haven't really tried any just going out and fighting stuff to grind experience or anything. That's been completely unnecessary. Can I get some with that? With the hunting log? Realistically. Plenty of experience to be had. The question is if we can get all the way to, like, max level by just doing the main story. I would assume you'd have to do some of the extra stuff. But main story plus hunting log plus dungeons plus guild hests and bonuses. I got the bombs. Outlaws. Like explosions are definitely something. Destroy the barricade. So they're throwing bombs over the barricade. That's pretty wild. things. Dirty complete. <laughs> Amazing. And I'm in this chat. No, I'm just 
That's fine. There we go. We did it. Mm -hmm. Bonus. That's good. Okay. <laughs> Definitely some nice, quick experience. The actual dungeon was definitely significantly more of the whole thing. Anything else? Ah, this is locked up being level 30. Perfect. So we know that one exists. That's fine. Alright. Back to this again. <laughs> Do we have an overarching goal? I'm just trying to help out. Still haven't put on our old bow, new bow yet. <laughs> Should probably do that. <laughs> Let's see the bow. Like, oh yeah, I have a new one of those. Do you have such a goal? Large or small, it matters not. Only have a star to reach for, and you will reach higher. Purpose can sustain you through times of hardship. Keep your eye on the prize, and all obstacles will be overcome in time. You would not think to stride into battle unclad, would you? Well, goals are as Arms and armor for the spirit. Wish you fortune in your endeavors, sir. Bye. Alright. Back then, are you? With all your limbs and a tale to tell, I wager. Oh, yeah. There's a whole thing. Fishbacks? And there I was thinking, you'd only have to crack a pirate skull or three. Seven hells. You turn your back for five bloody minutes, and the scaly bastards have set up shop on your bleeding doorstep. Still, sounds like you left them in pieces, so I don't suppose they'll be carrying out whatever mischief they were planning. Unless they was planning on feeding themselves to the fauna of Sestasha, of course. Anyway, all's well that ends well. On behalf of Limza, I thank you for shedding some light on this mystery. You've lived up to your reputation, and I couldn't ask for no more than that. Now all you... All Bet you're dying for a rest, but just in case you're not, I was wondering if you might be interested in taking on another job. Just so happens that I've had a request from our sister guild in Redania, see? Seems the forest folk are in need of a venture, while well, I can get things done. For them to ask for help like this, you bet the task won't be no skip through a sunny glade. After the way you dealt with our fishback infestation, I doubt it's anything you can't handle. Here's a shot when you're ready. I'll lay it out for you. Alright. Complete. <laughs> it's just going all over the place now. Wild. Party finder unlocked. Okay. Whoa, over we're this is party for things. Hmm? Party finder? This is duty finder. That's parties. Or that's something else. Dungeons. Why do you say party? Yeah, whatever. <laughs> we didn't even get a button saying party finder unlocked. Here's information about it. I'm gonna say we're not gonna worry about it. Get some potions. Information on a new task. I think we will take on a new task next time. Goodbye.